We live in a throwaway society. We're buying fast food, fast fashion, and fast cars. Meanwhile, the mountains of waste in distant parts of the world are piling higher. Today, the number of end-of-life tires has reached 1.6 billion worldwide. So the big question is, what to do with this huge amount of old wheels? Just dump them in the ocean. That was the clever idea of scientists back in the 1970s. The result was a disaster for the environment. These days, we recycle roughly 70% of old tires. The shredded material gets reconstituted into artificial grass, athletic tracks or asphalt, among other things. But the rest is burned as fuel in cement plants, which is a tremendous waste of precious raw materials. Together with the Swedish startup Enviro, we plan to go one step further and break the worn tires down into their basic elements. The technology is called pyrolysis. Using high temperatures, the shredded tires are reprocessed into carbon black, gas, steel and oil, thereby recycling 100% of the valuable raw materials. The partnership enables us to provide brand new recycling solutions while also developing new business for the group. Right now, we're building our own recycling plant in the Antofagasta region in Chile, near to the world's largest copper mines, incorporating Enviro's technology. The factory will recycle up to 30,000 tons of mining tires a year. Just one of these tires stands four meters tall and weighs several hundred kilos. Imagine how much raw material we can reclaim from that. Perhaps we can't change the world, but we can make a difference in our field of business, tires. Together with Enviro, we're one step closer to our vision of achieving 100% sustainable tires by 2050, when old tires will become new ones without any waste. Oh.